Hyatt Stewart Sutton at one acre plus homes with Remax One. Homes in Woodland Park in Georgetown, Texas in 2017 compared to 2016 is what we're going to spend the next few minutes looking at. Woodland Park is a community in Georgetown, Texas with homes on an acre or more. Now, most of these homes, the lot sizes don't vary dramatically. Most are on right about an acre. Now, you can see there was a dramatic increase in 2017 compared to 2016. 50% increase in home sales. Now, that's not quite as dramatic as it sounds because that really is 27 homes in 2017 compared to 18 homes in 2016. There were more spec homes in 2017 than in 2016. So that helped increase the number of home sales a little bit. But nice increase in the number of homes sold in Woodland Park. The average sale price increased very slightly to 545000 This is not always indicative of appreciation. Bottom line is that a year ago, 2016, we saw about 5.5% increase in average sale price. In 2017, a very slight increase in average sale price. The fact that the price per square foot fell slightly with this small of a pool of data does not tell you that homes are falling in price. But what it does tell you is that more of the larger homes sold and the price per square foot on larger homes tends to be a little bit less. So if larger homes sold, you would think that average price would have gone up a little bit more. So what this tells us is that Woodland Park is starting to settle in a little bit and it's not quite as dramatically increasing it was in 15 and 16. The days in the market did fall. So that's good. Even though it's minus, which you would think would be in red, minus days in the market is a positive. That means it's selling faster. So average days in the market for Woodland Park is about 81 days, which is faster than the average home on an acre or more. List to sale ratio is what a buyer is willing to pay. So buyers were willing to pay closer to asking price in 2017 than they were 2016 by about two thirds of a percent, which with an average price range of 545,000, two thirds of a percent is a nice little chunk of money. Here's something that's I find a little bit of interesting. Uh, in 2017, more homes sold over 600,000. And actually, there was a home sale over 700000 So in 2016, there were only two sales over 600000 in Woodland Park. In 2017, there were three times that many, six home sales over 600000 So Woodland Park has broken and is moving along well in that 600000 plus price range. Six homes out of 27 were over 600000 in 2017. So here's the summary. The number of home sales is up. Average price is up all of very slightly. The average price per square foot down very slight. And that just shows us more of the larger homes sold than a year ago. But the average price per square foot being down is a little bit indicative that Woodland Park is settling just a little. Average list of sale is up. Buyers are paying closer to asking and homes are selling a little faster. So the only negative stat we saw was the average price per square foot. Conclusion, all stats but one are still positive. So Woodland Park is still a strong market. Now, remember, you can see all homes in Woodland Park in Georgetown, Texas at oneacreplus.com. Thanks so much.